concentration. What's up, YouTube? What's up, MT Squad? It's your girl, Mika Lachey. Squad, we hard. Oh, Lord. What's up, everybody? For those of you who come across this video, if you aren't subscribed to the channel, go right now, subscribe to the channel. Make sure you have your notification bells on so you'll be notified whenever we drop a video or whenever we go live. Next, smash the like button, y'all. So, for those of you who have not um, tapped into what's been going on lately, I got a little update or whatever. So, the last video we did, we uploaded a video about, you know, my daughter being bullied or whatever. So, y'all, Miss Thang want to still keep going and still, you know, be messy or whatever. So, let's jump into it. So... A few days ago, um, so as y'all know, my, my daughter's best friend is the one who recorded the video, okay? My daughter's best friend, right? Okay. So, her mom sent me, you know, some screenshots. And so, I read the screenshots. So, she basically sent me the screenshots of the girl, you know, who my baby had to fight with. She inboxed her daughter asking her for the video of the fight still keeping up mess still being messy so boom i'm finna show y'all what she said so she said so she said blank send me the fight you recorded so my baby friend said who is you she said, just send the fight. She said, sent. That lets you know, baby, she need to be in school. She read what she need to be. But anyway, just sent the fight. My baby friend said, no. She said, why? She must lost, LOL, because you was recording. My baby friend said, she won, and I'm not finna send you no fight, because I don't know you. And even if I did, you still not finna get it. Period. That's what a friend's supposed to do. So, um, so the next thing she said, she said, what you need to fight for to show people that you got beat up and I'm not finna argue with you either. Now stop blank, blank, blank. So she said, who said I was finna show somebody? I'm just saying I want the fight. Stop texting my phone back. She said, and I want to see, did I get my ass beat? And I want to see. Who's on the ground. And I want to see who mama was trying to swing on me. Just up the fight. Simple as that. So. Um. She was like. Um. Da -da -da -da. She, like she said. She said. I, uh, she won. I'm not going to send you no fight. Because I don't know you. And even then. You still not going to get it. She said. Oh baby. This the girl. She had a fight with. And I want my fight. So go on up the video. If she won, give me the fight. She said, don't call me, baby, because I'm not your baby. It never gave uh Oh, she trying to say, and who gave it to you? Who gave you my IG? The girl was like, baby, baby, baby. And blank gave me your Instagram. And I ain't finna argue with you. Just give me the fight. Simple. But anyway... You know, y'all know how little girls be or whatever. Y'all know how it is when little girls get into it. But yeah, this my thing right here. So this little girl done put her mama in some stuff that her mama ain't ready for. This little girl done added her mama into this whole mix or whatever. And now just because you want to be messy and you going to other folks and all this type of stuff, your mama got to deal with whatever repercussions that I'm finna put behind whatever you was doing. And by that, 
I mean, her mama had too much mouth, y'all. Her mama had too much mouth out there that day when we uh was out there and the police, she called the police on us. Her mama had too much mouth. Her mama was sitting there with whoever it was, her cousin or girlfriend, best friend, auntie. I don't know who it was. It looked like she had a more deal out there too. Cause baby, the lady looked old. And the lady was sitting there like, Lord, why these folks got me out here? But yeah, she had more deal and somebody else with her. But anyway, back to what I was saying. So she was out there doing a lot of camping, y'all. And I forgot to tell y'all why she was out there camping or whatever. My auntie pulled up. Mm-hmm. <laughs> My auntie pulled up. So... My auntie pulled up or whatever. And um in the in the midst of everything, the police was still talking to me. So my auntie couldn't just, you know what I'm saying, in a rope or whatever. But my auntie was like, I know all them. Like, they from Happy Hill. So what's going on? So, you know, I told my auntie what was going on or whatever. And my auntie was like, go, baby, we'll tear that hoe up out there. Baby, we'll move goddamn bushes, concrete, and everything out there, bitch. And, and, and I meant that. I meant that. We was not playing. But see, the thing is, girl, folks know who you is, whoever her little sidekick was. Folks know who you are. So while you run around here trying to threaten folks and say you're going to do this, baby, you got to stand 100% behind it. Because I swear, y'all, I'm not playing. On my mama, my grandmama, on my chair, on me, when I see her. And whoever her little sidekick was, I promise y'all, I'm not finna play. I'm finna boop, boop, boop. I'm finna do what I got to do. Because, like, where I'm from, you're not finna say all this stuff to me. You're not finna swear that you're gonna do this, that. You're not finna tell me you're finna do anything to me. You're not doing it. <laughs> I'm not going for that. That's not gonna happen. So, whenever I see them, the only thing I say is, I just pray Tony be with me. Because somebody, I'm gonna need somebody to come pick me up from the police station. That's it. That's all I'm, that's, I just need somebody to pick me up from police station. That's it. Now, if I ain't got nobody around me, you know what I'm saying, I, I probably ain't gonna do it because I'm gonna need somebody to make sure, you know what I'm saying, my car and everything, you, you know what I'm saying? But other than that, baby, if Tony with me or somebody, a friend, somebody with me that can let folks know what happened and they need to come pick me up, baby, I'm in that ass. I'm in that ass like a piece of doodle turd. I'm in it. And I'm not playing. While what's her name? I don't know what her name is, but a little slow. While the little slow looking lady was trying to jump in some shit, Tony was like, oh, I know her. Man, I went to school with her. Tony was like, oh, she lying. She was lying. Folks picked on her in school. Then Tony was like, and everybody said, she, she used to smell like fish. So you mean to tell me you got a little fish stick trying to jump in stuff for you? Little fish stick. Little fish stick. You got a little fish stick trying to jump in stuff with you. And like I said, y'all, um, they my auntie said they from Happy Hill. For those of you who do not know, you know, what Happy Hill is, Happy Hill is a project. The same project Honeycomb breaks from. But guess what? Baby, I'm from Ordo. That's the project. And one thing about it, baby, you sit here talking to folks and, and saying this that you gonna do this and that. They don't fly. And then I would see this smile. So I don't know what would cause a person to say they going to do something to somebody like they not going to see them. Baby, Mobile, Alabama is small as hell. I'm going to see your, your ass again. I'm going to see your big back ass, whoever, friend, cousin. I'm going to see that hoe again. I'm going to see that, that slow looking, ooh, riding short bus looking ass bitch again. I'm going to see her again. Like, what make y'all think folks ain't gonna see y'all again? And for whoever see this video, if y'all know who I'm talking about, you can let them know. But I'm I'm dead serious. I want my one-on-one -on -one with both of them hoes. I'm not playing. I'm not the person to be sent here playing with. I don't bother nobody. So don't bother me. Don't fool with me. Like I said, their daughter is getting them and stuff that they cannot back up. Her mouth is just reckless. Like I said, people have to show up for what they say. And your daughter going to get you beat up. Her mouth. And going to people trying to say this and say that. Like she can whoop everybody, beat everybody, bully everybody. Bitch not over here. Bitch not over here. So, like I said, it's up when I see Ann one of them. To the heavens. To the heavens. It's to the heavens with you when I see any one of y'all. 
So, all that stuff you were doing outside, get ready for it. But anyways, um, so, let me say this one thing. I feel like I was taking pity on her. Not too long ago, I was taking pity on her. Because when she would find my baby, my baby snatched her wig off. And I ain't trying to be funny, but I'm being honest. My baby snatched her wig off. And y'all, you know how you have your hair braided up under the wig? She had her hair braided in there. It was just like everywhere. Hair was everywhere. It was looking like a scarecrow. Like, and she literally, after she had the fight, picked the wig back up and put it back on her head. Now, I'm not being funny, but like I said, I don't think her mom cared too much because it ain't no way that you should have your daughter wearing the wig and the wig look like that it supposed to be in the trash. The wig was supposed to be gone. Like y'all know how you get baby doll hair. You get a baby doll and the hair be nappy fell. And you can't get that hair untangled. And you gotta throw the baby doll hair away. That's how her wig was. And I feel like if you is her mom, why would you even keep letting her wear it? If anything, tell her to wear her real hair. Like what why would you let your daughter keep wearing a wig that looked like that? It's just, it just was giving, her mama ain't even a mama to her. Like, that's why she going through what she, that's why she doing what she doing. But the thing is, your mama need to be a mama instead of your friend. Because the mama ain't like, she giving friend vibes. She want to be her child friend. She went telling her child, okay, this messy. Why you doing this? This got to stop. So, I'm, I'm, I'm a guess that the mama scared of the daughter. But I'm going to tell you something. <laughs> she, me, neither my uh, baby is scared of them one of y'all. And them one. So, you, the mama should have been trying to tell her child not to go around trying to bully folks. But the mama don't care. The mama don't care. And then when the child get into some shit and somebody else mama, me, <laughs> me, when somebody else mama get on the child ass and and they got to go get their mama, the mammy is like, cricket, cricket, gone. The mama ain't helping the child. She came that first day, did all that kept it, and that was it. And now she she gonna get her ass beat behind it, because why? Because her goddamn mouth, and because, because why? Her daughter, and because she won't be a mom and discipline her child, and tell her child that you don't need to be bullying and being messy and starting shit. She just let her do whatever. So now the mama gotta pay for what the repercussions that the goddamn daughter started, and she's going to. But anyway, like I said, I had felt sorry for her when I seen that because it's just, it's giving, the mama just don't care. And the mama was looking thawed away too. But yeah, I guess I don't know what to say. I just don't know what to say. I just know we ain't for none of this shit. I ain't for none of this shit and baby, we ain't finna play. And like I said, I can't wait till I catch Either one of them. It can be separate together, whatever. I cannot wait. And I'm not playing. You will not talk about you finna do what to who? Bitch who? And what? And what like? If I was just don't even be knowing, you'll get yourself mm, playing with folks. Because I'm one of them. I'm not finna play with them, bitch. Now, nigga, now, ho. I'm not finna play with nobody. I'm not. And I'm, I'm ready to fight, but guess what? <laughs> If two hoes um, try to think they finna fight me, baby, I ain't, I'm ain't. i just gonna let you know. Baby, you gonna be uh, rejoicing with your ancestors. Hallelujah. You gonna be rejoicing with your ancestors. And that's on me, my children, uh, my granny, my mammy. That's on everybody. I love, baby. I'm not finna play with you. So folks better get their shit together real quick and get their child in line. 
Cause I don't mess with nobody and I'm damn sure I'm not finna let nobody mess with me or my my child, my kids. And that's just motherfucking it. Now, if you come across this video, y'all make sure y'all subscribe to the channel. Please make sure you subscribe to the channel. Make sure y'all smash the like button on the way out. If you ain't smash it on the way in. And I will see y'all good people on the next video. Peace.